Hey guys, happy Saturday. I totally forgot to start filming before I did my makeup, um, but today we are off to the Create and Cultivate Beauty Summit here in New York. I'm so excited. It's basically like a mini version of their conferences, but this one's like just about beauty, which is really cool, um, but it's not quite as long as the like full day conferences. This is just from like 10 to 5.45, I think. So yeah, I'm really excited. Um, makeup's done. I did my hair last night, so I just need to take it down. And now I'm trying to figure out what to wear. I had like an outfit in mind, and then I thought Ashley had a blazer that I could wear with it, and she doesn't. So now I'm like trying to scramble to find something else to wear. So hopefully I come up with something cute. Um, yeah, we're off to that today, and it's Cinco de Mayo, so we might pop into our favorite Mexican food restaurant to eat dinner afterwards hopefully we'll see how busy it is it might be like insanely crowded but we'll see but yeah that's what we're doing today and you're coming along with us all right so this is the outfit that i went with i'm going to bring my madewell bag i'll link all of this down below except for the shirt this is from zara like three years ago but it has cacti on it and so i thought that was perfect for um cinco de mayo these are my old navy jeans um, oh, and my new shoes from Free People, which I will link down below, and then we'll probably put all of this on the blog, on our shop page, so that you can shop everything. Right, I found Ash. <laughs> now we are off to get a cab, and then we're heading downtown. We have to take a cab because Ashley decided to wear heels. <laughs> I did not. So I think she should pay for the cab. <laughs> you want a cab in those shoes anyway? Yeah, go on. <laughs> as well. The ones I feel the most connected to are the ones where I actually know the owners of the brand and they talk about their daily struggles and um, not just show products whenever they come out. And as well as just being really consistent, I think that uh, in today's world of social media, just posting or uh, being on your social channels like once a week or once a month isn't going to cut it. You really have to be um, present every single day. So I think, yeah, finding what makes you unique and being consistent. Um, hi, my name is Kristen S. N. I'm a hairstylist and a co-founder of originally a beauty website, and then now my own brand, um, Kristen's Hair Target. Well, so you actually started in finance, um, and then obviously have transitioned your career completely. Um, I think that's something a lot of women go through: is they start from one thing, they want to transition to another, they have no idea how to do it. Can you walk us through what that experience was like? Yeah, I mean, I, I I really wanted to move to LA for the weather. I used to live in New York, so no disrespect to New York, but uh, I really wanted to change. I've been working in finance for a decade. All right, so we have had two panels. It's been really great so far. Now we're having a lunch. We have like a chicken wrap thing, vegan bowls. So good. So we have lunch for like an hour, and then we have a couple more panels. Um, and then a big break. Oh, I didn't say we went and got, I don't think I filmed anything because it was hard, but we got little mini manicures. Um, Olive and June, who if you saw our very first LA vlog from like two years ago, we got our nails done there. We got little manicures here, a sticker that is not going to focus on them, but it's on our Insta stories and it'll be on our Insta stories for when you see them. Well, what I mean by that is I definitely, I quoted it saying like Young Jeezy, but apparently it's puffy. That's what my Uber driver told me. Um, fact checked in Uber, but I said sleep when you die. I was like, like Young Jeezy. Um, but it's one of those things that's something I truly believe. It's, you have as many hours in the day, the quote, as Beyonce, but it's what you do at that time. And I know we, we talked about self-care, and one of the things that comes to mind in balancing all my many hustles is I know that I can't give 100% to everything. There's no such thing. But what I can do is when I'm in that moment, that 25% of the five things that I'm doing with the four things that I'm doing, I can give that 25 or 30 percent of my attention, and that's realistic. No one's like telling you to work 100 percent. I say, you guys, Create Cultivate has the best snacks. Always oh, baked by Melissa, kombucha, 
coffee. Ashley just finished more coffee. I don't know where she put it. We have bags full of snacks. There's snacks everywhere. We just eat the entire day, pretty much. We're on our break right now. We're having snacks and coffee, like I just showed you. Um, I'm gonna talk about these. Hashtag not sponsored, but I wish they were. So if you didn't know this about me, one of my guilty pleasures is hot Cheetos. And I cannot buy them, and I cannot eat them because yeah, I'm like cinnamon. -y. Sorry, not okay. <laughs> Anyway, I cannot buy them or eat them because I will sit there and eat the whole bag. So I don't, and they're terrible for you. So the good thing about Pretty Cold Lane is like at every single one of these, they have like all these new like products and all the snacks that you can take right here are like really healthy. They're big on health and wellness and like organic eating and everything. So they have these, which they're calling Keto instead of Cheetos, and they're made with pea flour, lentil flour, and fava bean flour. So there's no corn, which is what I like. I try and stay away from corn if I can. And they're like hot Cheetos. And I've had like two bags of them already. And they're so good. And we just got Mulan phone cases. They're Otterbox phone cases. I love good Mulan, so I'm all about that. It's been a good day so far. You having fun? I'm fun. Their friends on the phone, they say, What is Mario doing? They're like, Oh, he works at a clothing store in Manhattan. Like, we don't, you know, he works in retail. Um, so, you know, my mother, when she found out, she basically, I mean, I think the first thing out of her mouth was, You know, please, I'd rather you be a plumber, construction worker, a sanitation man, anything. She said, Please do not do this. Um, so it was really rough. Um, How has your beauty routine changed with all of those commitments? I think my beauty routine has gotten a lot faster, you know, I, I'm a very active participant in my own beauty and I mean that, like I love to read about the best products and you know, what's out there, what works, what doesn't work. I'm a product for it in that way, like a total product junkie, um, but I think it's changed in a way that less is more. Like. Well guys, we wrapped up a fun day. We're in a cab on our way back home. Got our like goodie bags, which we'll go through when we get back. It was a really fun day. I'm tired. tired. I'm so tired. You just have to be like on all day and it's just like Ashley, I don't think she told you guys, but we had a cocktail and haven't eaten dinner. Um, Wouldn't recommend that. <laughs> Um, she was like, it's just an overstimulating day, and that's true. It's just there's so much going on. It's, it's there's great. There's a lot of pretty things to look at. There's yeah. a lot of people talking. You're just like really focused, and even though we weren't doing much besides sitting in chairs, um, it's just kind of like a lot to take in. So uh, I just need like a bit to chill. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry. But it was really fun. If you guys ever get the chance to go to any Create and Cultivate event, go. They're announcing their new city soon and um, we'll probably be there. So. All right, wow. I look tired and rough. Ashley was the one who's actually really tired. I slept a while last night. It was just, like we said, it's like an overstimulating yeah. day. But now we are out and we're going to another coffee shop. I need more coffee. I just had one cup today. Yeah, I only had one and I need just like some food. It's like a little pick me up. And then as weird as it sounds, a new CVS opened by us, which I know that's like so not exciting at all. Not to the normal person, but in New York drugstores are like Ulta. Yeah, they're really cool. So we're gonna head to that one because I think they have well, Alex went this morning actually and she sent a picture of like this entire like face mask wall, which I'm really excited about. Yeah. So there's not gonna all see what we can find. have a face mask wall. That is true. So I think we're gonna head there. Alex is actually meeting us at the coffee shop. So yeah.
coffee we went with Al to pick up Papa Monroe. She was having a bath at her daycare place. Oh, right now it's hot. <laughs> um, and now we are off to the fancy CVS, and I hope it's really cool. I'm ready for some face masks. I don't know what else I need. Actually, I need, there's some eye drops that I need to get for um, after my surgery on Friday. So I might get those if they have them. If not, they're on Amazon, but just gonna see. It's a big CBS, so I'm hoping to have a big selection because I know our Dwayne Reed, I don't think, has exactly what I need. Do you like hello <laughs> snail skin lotion? I love snail skin snail stuff. Snail essence, snail hydrogel eye patch. How much are these? Are like fourteen dollars a month. Okay, we've been in here approximately two minutes. Shelby already has stuff in her. <laughs> it's really good suction here. It's like all Korean. Night relaxing jelly eye sheet mask. Wait, this is interesting. I heard about this. This moisturizer. People love this. This peach slices thing. I just kind of want one of everything. Ooh, yeah. Iceland hydrating eye stick. What is that? I don't We're know. We have to do like a haul on all of this. I'm gonna get this moisturizer because I heard good things about it. Okay, I think we need a basket. <laughs> Why don't you go get? Two baskets because the face mask wall is back there, and I'm gonna grab one of each. <laughs> that is an entire face mask. Wow. and chia. I'm about that life for sure. So I got, they had face masks that were like five for 12 or oh, something yeah. like that. So I got five different <laughs> ones. I got so a lot. This one's a blueberry so one. This one is a coffee milk mm -hmm. and this is a vitamin C one. And I really just like the packaging of this. The brand is Peach Slices, which is cute. This is a firming mask that mm -hmm. is pomegranate and honey. And then this looked interesting. It, they call it a steam eye mask. And it's an over eye mask, not an under eye mask. Interesting. It's like heat, like air heat activated. Poppy's trying to get in my bag. It looks interesting. This is my pile of masks. So I got a baby silky foot mask. Those are good. Yeah. Is that the peely one or is she? No, I don't think so. I don't think it peels. Well, that's called a baby foot mask, so that's why I was just curious. I don't think so. Hope not. <laughs> All right, Ashley made me get the carrot face mask. I did, because I don't eat carrots. So she can mask <laughs> with them. Um, so I got two of those peach slices ones. I got this clarify one and a shrink pores one. Um, oh, this is what I'm going to do today, just because it's chocolate milk, and I thought that was really cool. Um, I got the strawberry milk one, too. Uh, let's see. Oh, these juice cleanse masks. Uh, raspberry and lentil and spearmint and green oh. apple. 
I'm excited about that. Oh, that's not a face mask. Um, this collagen mask and then this calm one. And then I got these, which I've seen people talk about. These are acne spot dots. You know, guys know I've been like breaking out like crazy. So I think you put these on like overnight. Like they're like these little dots and I think you put them like on your like pimple overnight. And then when you wake up in the morning, like it's going to be gone. We'll see. I think you got these too. Oh yeah, I did. Did you get these? Yep. So these are, this is a peach slices, citrus, honey, aqua glow I've moisturizer. heard about this moisturizer. I saw somebody on Instagram talking about it and they really liked it. And then we got this little stick. It's called the Iceland Hydrating Eye Stick. Um, I love anything Iceland. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, is, this, is it a cute little polar bear? Hang on, stop. <gasps> oh, that's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Look how cute Stop that it. is. Oh my god. See, what sucks is I'm not going to be able to use this stuff for like weeks. Oh my god, we know you're having eye surgery. You'll be fine. I'm just annoyed <laughs> I can't do my skincare. <laughs> wow, that is super cute. Is that all you got? I have more stuff. Um, I mean, the rest of my stuff isn't exciting. I got yeah. some Aleve and some more melatonin to them out. And then sugar-free lifesavers. I actually look for of these a lot of places because I like the sugar-free ones, but I like the peppermint ones. Mm -hmm. Now, I can always find sugar-free wintergreen, but I like peppermint. Wintergreen's where it's at. That's all I got. Um, let's see, I got some vitamin C gummy vitamins because I heard that vitamin C helps with the healing process after um, your eyes. So I'm going to take these and I'm going to get some orange juice to drink a lot. Um, okay, these. You should have seen my reaction in store when She these. screamed, oh my gosh. Yeah. Really so bad. where did, oh, I think mom gets them from Sprouts. Oh no. Um, yeah, mom gets them from Sprouts. There's these little like fruit bar pie thingies and they're so good. They're vegan, gluten free, and I could never find them anywhere here. And they had the blueberry and the strawberry one here at CVS, so I picked up those. Oh, and then I also saw these, which I thought were interesting. They're butter toffee organic superfood snacks. How much food did you get? A lot. Um, they're made bit. with sunflower seeds, coconut sugar, flax seeds, pumpkin seeds, chia seeds, and just like vanilla and butter toffee flavoring. So that was a good snack. That's it. All right. Yay. Pop up. You want to say hi to your friends? Pop up got that. To see smells it's so good. She's looking out the window <laughs> instead of at me. She wants me I to open it. Off. Ooh. Hi, sweet girl. All right, so that's what we got at CVS. Um, the rest of the day, I don't really know. TV. Yeah, catch up on the TV. Which catch up on the more to wash my hair. And do face masks. Mm -hmm. Okay. Say happy Sunday fun day. All right, so I was just editing this video and I realized that we didn't end it. And the last thing we did was do our little CVS haul. Um, we literally didn't do anything else for the rest of the weekend. Just sat on the couch and watched TV. But hope you guys really enjoyed this vlog. The next vlog you're gonna see is with my eye surgery, which is crazy. That's happening in three days now. So I'm starting to get a little nervous for it, but it'll be fun. It'll be great. I'm gonna document everything so you get to see everything from start to finish but if you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up and you can subscribe to our channel right there and then you can watch our latest video if you haven't seen it right there we'll see you guys next time bye